Hey, what's up YouTube? This is Lawman FJ. Gonna take a quick look at some cases from iBlazon. Now these cases are actually updates. I looked at them before when they first came out and they're for the Galaxy S20 Ultra, but there've been some improvements. Let's go ahead and check it out. Okay, so we got two cases. One is the Cosmos and one is the Aries series case. They're both made by iBlazon. And again, there were updates uh, to previous versions that were put out earlier. Uh, these have screen protectors on them. So they're built-in screen protectors, and we're gonna see how they work with the Galaxy S20 Ultra. Okay, so this is the Cosmos. Uh, let's go ahead and take this out. Now, it's the uh, sort of uh, rose gold looking color. Back is the same right there. Let's get this stuff out of the way. You know, they have their thank you card inside there. But this is the cover that goes on the front. Now, the, the previous version did not have a screen protector built in. You can see this is where they're telling you to put the screen protector. Now, one of the things we'll have to pay attention to, I still have my Samsung pre-installed protector on the phone, and I'm not gonna take it off. Now, we're gonna see how this works with that screen protector on and this built-in screen protector here. I'll, what I think I'm gonna have to do is add another fingerprint to adjust to this being on. So we'll try first to see how it works and then if we have to make an adjustment, we'll do that, okay? So let's go ahead and peel these plastic off. That's off that. And then uh, we can take the plastic off this on the front. And then there's one inside as well. And then we gotta peel off the uh, sticker inside for the fingerprint scanner, all right? All right, so I put the front piece on, you just kind of slap that on the front there, and then you, you go ahead and install this inside the uh, back of the, uh, the back piece of the screen. Make sure you get that on so everything is uh, around the, the body real good. It's all sealed up. All right, now we're gonna see if the screen protector works uh, with the fingerprint scan. All right, so it worked. No problem there. Now you want to make sure you have no bubbles or anything underneath the screen, but it did work this time. So first time, I didn't have to do anything, didn't have any problems. Let's go ahead and good. Now I did, so it works. Now I, I held my hand there on the, on the sensor. Now if I touch it, if I just tap it, let's see what happens. So it opened up, works well. So kudos to iBlazon, this works really well. No problem with the screen protect. I still have the, the pre-installed Samsung on there. No problem with that, so it works, all right? Let's try it one more time. No problem. Screen protector and the fingerprint sensor works well, all right? Okay, so this case is the Aries Savers Series case. You've seen this one before as well. Let's get the plastic off of this, off the back. And same thing here, you got a front cover that now has a screen protector uh, on the uh, actual uh, screen, front front piece there. So let's take this plastic off. There's some on the inside as well. Okay, so we got the front plastic off the front piece. Let's go ahead and put in the device. So we put this on the uh, device first, like that. Now you wanna make sure there's no bubbles or anything in between. Uh, and let's see if it works as well as the other case that we had on there. So let's slide this inside. Make sure everything is uh, all seated properly and around. Now let's uh, go ahead and test out the uh, fingerprint sensor. It worked well on the last device. Let's see how it works on this device. So it works, well, works pretty good there, no problem there. All right, now as I said, if you have a problem with the fingerprint sensor, go ahead and reinstall your uh, second fingerprint sensor if you don't wanna take off the pre-installed screen protector that Samsung had on the device. But it's working all right for me, no problem. No problem there, I think you're gonna be all right, okay? All right, so that was a quick look at the updated cases from iBlazon, the Cosmos case, and the Aries series case. They both have built-in screen protectors on them now. They will work, I just showed it to you. Uh, so you can go ahead and check them out if you want that to get that extra protection, you can do that. Uh, if you have this pre-installed screen protector from Samsung on the device, it should still work, I just did that because I have it on my device. But if you, it doesn't work, you might want to either take that screen protector off or install a second fingerprint to update that uh, for the screen that you have on right now, all right? Now, if you got any questions, hit me up in the comments. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. 
And don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below for more videos like this. This is Lawman FJ, out.